I'm glad people are beginning to love the blues. And one of the guys who really helped that situation along was that guy on In Living Color, you know, the one who did stuff like, wrote a song about it, here it go. Sitting in abstention room, wondering what they abstained from. You know that guy? That guy helped a lot to get people to like the blues. Now there was a guy by the name of Elmore James came up from Mississippi. Elmore was like the beginning of a lot of different kinds of music. He was the beginning, part of the beginning of rock and roll too. Cause Elmore, when he got to uh, Chicago up from Mississippi, found out that old guitar he had just wouldn't amplify good enough, you know. He needed something that was a little bit stronger, so he put a pickup in it, and all of a sudden he had this distorting sound, you know, coming through that overloaded cheap amplifier, and that gave the world an entirely new sound and approach to the blues. Now, Elmo, when he came to Chicago, only had one song. But like any good enterprising blues man, he just like made up, you know, 100 lyrics to that one lick. So this was the lick, and this was the song. Thank you. Thank you so much. You've been a great audience. Thank you.